You know, United Way has always been involved in disaster recovery, certainly as long as I can remember. But what's unique about United Way is that they're involved with the issue between storms, before events. You know, they're involved with preparing and organizing the community, creating the networks of individuals and organizations that are able to respond. And then they're very quickly up and running in a disaster because United Way is very resilient. They're just able, we're able to, to get the organization back on its feet very quickly. And then frankly, we, we're sta we stay involved with an issue longer than most. Uh, many other organizations will get involved, do what they can, and then uh, go on to the next issue. United Way stays with the community and into that long-term recovery that sometimes gets forgotten. You know, the United Way appreciates, by virtue of our experience with prior disasters, frankly, how long the recovery process takes. And we're both quick off, quick off the start in terms of getting money out into the community where it's most needed early on, but then we're patient with the money over time to get at those longer term needs that don't either surface immediately or can't be addressed successfully until other funds have either been, that have come into the community first or can be spent alongside our money. So the United Way thinks of disaster relief as a multi-year effort, two, three, four, five years beyond the event itself. We'll still be working with the community and individuals in the community to make the repairs, take the steps they need to fully recover.